Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Komi Can't Communicate episode number 12 and this is the final episode of this season. Alright, before we start, uh, I'm kind of like, you know, holding a poll. Uh, it is in the community tab, uh, you know, in my channel. Go there, there is like a poll where I'll be, I'll be reacting to one of the animes which I've chosen. Uh, you can go and vote there. The voting will be on up until 7th of January and you know on, on the 7th of january i'll like you know react start reacting to the anime which uh which has a maximum votes so anyway this is just something that i wanted to tell you guys you can go and vote there uh, i i chose a few animes like you know like 12 episode anime and which i have not seen so yeah anyways um that's something different all right so the previous episode of komi can't communicate um we are in the cultural festival um episode uh the festival has started in the school and uh, a lot of people like you know just like how a cultural festival goes uh, a lot of people like you know does like a lot of things different classes put out different like you know stalls and stuff uh and there are many other stuff you know many other fun stuff that they do so komi's class they had a little vote on it what they're going to do made cafe one <laughs> and um yeah that was that was really i have to say like I'm, I'm quite happy with this choice because you know everyone we can see everyone in their maid outfits and komi was also there and also surprise talan also <laughs> dressed up <laughs> and that was great like um i'll be honest here i really wasn't I wouldn't be able to recognize him if we didn't know that that's Tadano because you know like he with his wig and everything he looks completely different um so <laughs> since i knew that was Tadano, i was like okay yeah we can see the resemblance but if suddenly like you know she pops up in the start of the episode i would have thought that maybe this one this person is like a new character or something <laughs> it would be something like that so yeah that was a good like you know like good dressing um and uh yeah so we like you know a lot of things happened we've made a new character yeah i forgot about her for a second there oto isan uh she is very quiet and very like you know like kind of is a little bit slow with a lot of things uh i can uh, you know very uh, what can i say kind of a little bit of an uh has a ditzy character <laughs> <laughs> clumsy character kind of like that but yeah she's a nice person and you know she and komi kind of like you know had a like, little conversation she became friends with komi and um that was that we also met a person a guy uh who i think his name was tatsu he something like that i don't remember he is the maid master <laughs> he came and like you know like it was like kind of kind of ranking all the maids and everything and he was able to understand the charm of Komi as well <laughs> and all that stuff Komi's mom also came a lot of things were happening and yeah it it kind of went in like you know like this this will be a continuation of the previous episode so let's see what happens and also if you guys know this is the final episode of this season season 2 has been announced it is going to come out uh, roughly around April 2022 so not we don't have to wait much for 5 months we'll have to wait for that so yeah anyways let's start so this is the final episode of the season all right i'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here sync it to whichever is a preference and let's start all right here's the countdown three two one go oh my god komi that's komi isn't it i think so school culture festival oh is this, an, is this a new character i think so we saw him in the her in the previous episode as well wow dignified look at her <laughs> she's planning That's not how you Wow. Wow. Ah. Oh my god. Including taxes. <laughs> wow, she's good at this. 
Communication level is high. Wait for 60 minutes. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, what's... Oh no. What? Okay. Oh, oh wow. Wait, what? Just moves. <laughs> Snowball effect. Oh, okay, understand. Wow. <laughs> My God. Oh wow. Okay. <laughs> wow. My god, they're raking in money. One face slap, what? I've only seen that much money in... Go on. Okay, alright, enough. Enough. Yep, there they are. Yes. Refunded, okay. <laughs> Hopefully. Oh my god, what's what is he wearing? What's she wearing? Okay, okay that'll be good. True? <laughs> Being punished, okay. Yeah, this will act as a good advertisement, you know? Oh no, whoa! Oh! <laughs> Horrible haunted house. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, this is made really well, what the? Um. Oh my! Oh my God! It's cognac. Yeah. Odokara Shizuka. Wait, is that a new character? Shizuka. Is she always quiet or something? Yeah. <laughs> She's gone. All right. Well, you lost your chance. <laughs> wow. No, she's not. What? Under its confess. What? Oh, minor confession. What the? What type of a thing is this? Oh! <laughs> My God, his his school life is over. <laughs> his school life is over. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my God. I wonder what she's going to say. You know, as if that's not obvious. Okay. Well. <laughs> Alright, call me. Enough is enough. Let's go. <laughs> um... <laughs> Um, <laughs> like one thing I have to say, like it's good that, like you know, what can I say? Like, if no one would actually go there. Wait, what? Wait, what happened? Oh yeah, Komi won't. Komi don't doesn't speak. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. 
<laughs> what is she going to say? I I doubt this is possible. This is too big of a hurdle for her. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> Wait and believe. Okay. Oh, there they are. There she is. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, that is coming. <laughs> I'm listening, AD. Okay. Whoa. Made. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Okay. Wow, everyone's going to come now. Are you saying it from nervousness? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. Well, there you go. Who's this? Takes a oh, meditation club. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> well, <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> yep. We'll pray for you. <laughs> oh, did she uh, tug in her hair? I think so. Oh, yes! Yes, this is what I was waiting for. Oh my god. Yes! <laughs> oh my god. Perfect. Wait, this someone. Oh, everyone's. <laughs> yep. Oh. We. Oh. Oh my god, where is she? Ah! What? <laughs> okay, that was interesting. Wow, I l love the you know glasses with the tugged in you know hairstyle, the maid outfit. It's perfect with the with the head thing that maids wear. Oh. <laughs> Is that a bunny girl outfit? What the? <laughs> Oh, Nesuna san. <laughs> Obviously, she will be there. <laughs> Remaining time ice cream, okay. Wow, this is impossible. Like, that was a really good drawing. Usui Hon. Oh, Usui Hon, okay. Dojin Shi. <laughs> I know what a Usui Hon is. <laughs> Mm. Okay. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she's fine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, nice. All right. There you go. Fun time doesn't last long. Grand prize. What? Oh, the f okay. Meat cafe? Obviously. Like, everyone was there. Like, it would surprise me if they didn't win. Oh, no. Oh, no, everyone's going to. Oh, my God. Uh. Yeah, like <laughs> Yeah, okay <laughs> it, yeah, exactly. I was just going to say that it's so different when she says. <laughs> oh my god, this is perfect. What? Oh. Whoa. Oh my god. Uh Yeah, just ignore them. You know what's the good thing? A lot of people won't actually recognize Tadano if he actually dances with her. And <laughs> you know that'll be a Okay. <laughs> mm. Come on. Nah. <clears throat> All right, there you go. <laughs> okay. I'm I'm guessing a lot of people won't actually realize who Tadano is. Like, obviously his classmates will know. <laughs> Doesn't know how to... Uh, there you go. J just as I was saying. <laughs> okay. Um, enough. Najimi, go home. Uh. Whoa, what? <laughs> wow, they were just going to have a moment and... Oh my god, anyways... Uh, <laughs> I guess it's fine, as long as they have fun. <laughs> the ninja guy. What? <laughs> okay, karaoke. Will everyone really fit in this small place? Yeah, I think so. Oh no, okay, okay. Hmm. <laughs> oh, another bomb. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay <laughs> oh my god that was fun <laughs> time to sing okay
Oh my god. <laughs> she's acting around but she's confused. <laughs> oh no, she selected it. Oh boy. Okay. Let's hear her singing. I think she's probably very bad. Oh no, she was good. Okay. Never mind. Nah. <laughs> Endless world end. <laughs> All right, which anime song? There you go. <laughs> They're not showing us their singing, but I guess it would have taken a lot of time if they showed. She remembered he used to be a Chunivi and felt sorry. <laughs> Okay. Not say rhyme. <laughs> My God, calm down. Okay. All right, here we go. <laughs> It's just trying to. This is the opening song, isn't it? Yeah. I can clear it. Yeah, I hear it. Yep. <laughs> Zero, obviously. <laughs> oh, but she really is calling. <laughs> wow. B for chicken. What? <clears throat> what? Yeah. Huh. I'm sure Komi is listening. Oh, there you go. Hmm. <laughs> ah, she's complaining. <laughs> I think her his oh my god he's really into this <laughs> I think his scores will be very average or something let's see like 50 or something <laughs> yeah up oh. oh my god oh oh the opening song no, that was the ending song. This is the opening song. Okay, come on. Oh. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, 
Ah, thank God that season two has already been announced. It's it's going to come out in April 2022, and the wait is a little quite you know less like not that much. We have to wait for it, like three or four months maximum. Wow, we met a lot of people. I have to say, like you know, in these twelve episodes. Oh, what? Hmm. Lighting a letter? What is? No. Ah, and there you go. Yep. Oh, there you go, the friends. <laughs> Okay, I'll have to pause and count the number of people. Wow. That makes it difficult for a person to socialize. Oh, I'm okay. Mm, finished. <laughs> Uh, okay, do we continue? Yep, there you go. <laughs> yes, April 2022. Oh, <laughs> wow, it was <laughs> Yama is crying. Only 24 seconds left. What? <laughs> Yep, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, good. Well, there you go. Um <coughs> Right, okay, first of all, let me check one thing. Mm, uh, the thing that yeah, uh, how many num uh, number of friends? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I was correct. You know, I was keeping a count, and you know, in the comment section, I'm correct. It's thirteen. Thirteen friends. Good. All right. So this episode, the, this was the final episode of this season. So season two will start from April 2022 and it's good that the weight will be a lot lesser than a lot of animes i've seen you know there have been a lot of animes which were quite popular but still like for season two to come out it took one or two years thank god that's not the case here and <laughs> yeah we're going to get it a lot quicker than i thought i we would get um so okay <coughs> this episode <coughs> we are continuing from the previous episode the <coughs> cultural festival part and um here in the beginning <coughs> we say see them actually trying to advertise you know using komi like komi was doing a lot of things and <laughs> like you know like komi like uh, najimi was like you know what like go from this place to that place everyone will start following you and seeing everyone following you will make other people follow you and that's how you're going to make a komi snowball effect and that will be like you know best for the advertisement and yeah she was correct you know she she knows marketing <laughs> she's good at it and the way she was actually used <laughs> no like i've like you know like i know like in and i think in uh, maid cafes there are like you know stuff like this that maids do for example you know like little games they play maybe like rock paper scissor with you uh, maybe take a picture with you uh you kind know, of stuff like this uh and uh that's what they were actually doing here uh but you know they charge a little bit more like for example we saw Mak uh, makeru uh playing rock paper scissor with one of the uh, persons and um then there was like you know a few other things as well i think what else was there oh uh, yeah photographs um nakanaka was uh, uh, clicking photographs with others uh with the customers 
and then uh, Agari was you know like going alongside with uh, like you know other people and like you know having a little walk and everyone was like oh I'll pay money I'll pay money for this and like it, it went out of control for a second there <laughs> obviously this is okay in um you know like what can i say in, in like normal made cafes like this is fine like you know just like a marketing strategy but not for a school festival <laughs> you know this is not a business you're doing here <laughs> so najini went a little bit too far she was like ah i'm i'm swimming in money look at this money <laughs> and then in comes the i think the vice principal or something yeah kyoto and uh, gorimi both of them comes in and they're like yep <laughs> enough is enough you need to stop this and uh, yeah that was kind of fun and then still like you know even after that Najim was like no i need to do something you know, he was like she was he was like uh, she was like okay let's let's go alongside with komi and maybe after seeing him everyone will come and they have a little you know, walk around the whole festival thing oh we meet a new character here i forgot about them her um Odoka Shizuka. Odoka Shizuka. Shizuka means quiet, I think. Yeah. Shizuka means quiet. Odoka. I'm not so sure about Odoka. Let me just check her page just a second. Um, Odoka Shizuka. I think Odoka means something about uh, quiet or something. Odoka. Odoka. Uh, let's just wait. Let's just see. Okay, Odoka Shizuka. Um, is there anything written? No, I don't see anything. No, no, there's nothing. I can find the you know actual meaning of a name here in her wiki page. But obviously, like Shizuka means quiet, and Odoka probably means something like scared, like you know, scared, or is there something like that? Like something related to scared, or something like that. I'm not sure. So she's always like, you know, like I'm guessing she's kind of quiet at everything, and um, I don't know, anyways. And <clears throat> yeah, she was, she was there, she was acting as one of the ghosts in the <clears throat> haunted house. Not at it was done pretty well, you know. Hmm. And she was there. She was trying to uh, make Komi afraid, but obviously she hesitated a bit too much. <laughs> she was like, "Oh, like what am I going to do? Am I really supposed to scare her? Is it okay if I scare her?" But wait a minute. She came here because she wanted to get scared. So shouldn't I scare her? Like she was kind of going through like this, like in circles. <laughs> and while she was doing this, Komi just went past her and it is over I'm, I'm guessing we're probably going to see her later in the you know season two or something more of her and uh, yeah okay so and then comes the the confession minor confessions i think like i'm guessing this is about like small little confessions that people do now i don't know who the hell would even go on, on a rooftop and confesses their love for someone just to get shot down in front of the whole school i don't know who, who in the right mind would even do that <laughs> but there was one brave person we saw who just went up there and just confessed and the girl from underneath she was like nope i'm sorry <laughs> and there you go school life over <laughs> that's it my god <laughs> like what what the hell was that uh, but anyways um i guess <laughs> yeah okay so now and uh, that was that and then in uh, goes uh yamai now one thing i have to like you know uh, applaud you know f for her one thing i i'm, I'm quite impressed is that sh like i doubt anyone would actually go on top and profess their love for komi that's impossible because Pomi is like in a pedestal you know like people wouldn't even think about confessing to her that's like the what can i say the, the place that she is in so actually going to a rooftop and like you know profess like in confessing is something yeah i i have to say that's impressive at, even if that was yamai you know uh but i don't think yamai actually cares about anything you know she she just like she, she's crazy so yeah i think that's pretty normal for her to just go on top and 
I confess. <laughs> because she doesn't care. The only thing that she cares about is Komi. And whatever other people say or, you know, like think, she doesn't even care. Which, in a way, is quite good. Like, you know, a lot of people actually need this quality, you know, like actually not giving any damn about anyone, what anyone other says. Like, there'll always be a peanut gallery booing you for something, you know, uh, discouraging you or something like that. There will always be those type of people. So you should definitely not, like, you know, pay attention to them. Only take in criti uh, positive criticism. Not, mm, no, uh, yeah. Uh, only take those things in uh, co no, constructive criticism not positive criticism sorry constructive criticism you should only take those and ignore the other stuff like that in itself is a very good quality but unfortunately for Yamai she doesn't care about anything she neither does she care about the unnecessary trolling or bullying people does and she doesn't even take in constructive criticism she's she, she just doesn't care <laughs> that's the bad part of her but you know like uh, the, the thing that she did uh, on top and like you know confess that was you know that was i guess good like she 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 was the only one who actually went there and did that so uh, like i can uh, I, I have to applaud her for that anyways um <clears throat> then komi went up <laughs> that was <laughs> that was that was really <laughs> she she did a meow Oh my god, that that was that was funny. That was great, I have to say. Like you know that that Mia was was really cute. I have to say that. So yeah, <laughs> and everyone was like, oh, and uh, a cat maid, a cat maid. Komi is going to be a cat maid. Let's go, everyone. Like the whole school then follows, and yeah, the advertisement is successful. <clears throat> and then Najimi, you know, puts on a little cat ear on top of her head, which is very good you know <laughs> that was that was a good decision <clears throat> and okay we meet another character here i think like there's this girl that comes suddenly who says like uh the meditation club or something oh, wait a minute where is that part okay yeah um she calls najimi okay our meditation club is having a keisaku meditation practice event Home room teacher said that Najimi would definitely want to join. Okay, I don't know if we're going to get more of this girl in the future or not, but she looks like one of the probably one of the important characters, so who knows. Um anyways, um she comes in and <laughs> takes Najimi away from meditation, which I think is something that Najimi definitely needs to do, you know, meditate a little bit and calm down. <laughs> oh boy and then comes the best part of this episode my god i was just saying this you know i was just saying this in the previous episode i was saying that when uh, komi like you know like was talking about maid outfits uh, we get a little scene of komi uh, actually wearing a victorian maid outfit you know with the glasses with the hair like you know done in uh, tucked in with long sleeves long skirt I was like I would have really loved to uh, see Komi in that outfit not the outfit that we are seeing you know the normal Japanese made outfit not that one that's all well and good I'm not saying that's bad but I would have loved to say I was just saying in the previous episode that I would love to see Komi in that particular outfit with the the you know, Victorian made style uh, with, with the glasses the glasses is the important part <laughs> <laughs> and and the tucked in hair you know like like not not like you know flowing hair but it, it should be tied up and yeah they actually did it here in in this this part like i <laughs> that was fantastic that i don't know why but komi it, it really matches her you know that 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 uh that character like you know the dress that she's wearing with, with that uh, you know the thick rimmed glasses and you know like with the hair done in um yeah with the long sleeves and a black maid outfit and a white apron with a little maid head uh, like you know hair ornament that thing my god that was that was fantastic i that was the best part of this episode you know komi like actually in that outfit in that victorian style maid outfit wow that was well done i'm, I'm glad they actually did that <laughs> 
ओके एंड देन वी गो टू द डिफरेंट लाइक यू नो लाइक वी गो अराउंड द डिफरेंट इवेंट्स ओतोरिसन आल्सो जॉइंस अस ओ ओनेमिनो आल्सो जॉइंस अस या ओके देन दे पार्टिसिपेट इन अ फ्यू ऑफ द कांटेस्ट्स एंड स्टफ या देयर देयर वर अ फ्यू ऑफ द कांटेस्ट्स the the you know they were also drawing a sketch of her all that stuff they were doing they had fun in the end everything was like you know all well and good and uh, the festival was almost over it was like you know sun was setting um there was like a band you know underneath uh we're going to metal band rock metal band and uh, yeah that was that was beautiful and then comes another big thing which was the announcement of the winners <laughs> they were like yeah like itan made cafe wins but unfortunately because of najimi yeah you won't get the prize you'll have to hand it over to someone else <laughs> and najimi is like guys you know like is it really that important to win Didn't aren't we all friends? Didn't we have fun just you know participating it? Like that's the best part of our youth, just having fun, isn't it? <laughs> Tadan was like, no, like no, you can't get out of this. Just <laughs> oh boy, with a monotonous voice, you know, Tadan was like, no, what the hell are you even saying? <laughs> oh my god, uh, uh, like and, and then the funny parts come where <laughs> after that scene. Komi says the same thing. Komi says Komi is like, but it was fun, wasn't it? And everyone was like, yeah, you're right. <laughs> like you know, like I, like someone was even like you know shedding tears or something. Yeah, Netsuno, Netsuno was almost crying. Netsuno was like, yeah, you're right. You're you're hot. Like you know, you're up like you know two hundred ten degrees centigrade, and <laughs> your temperature is high. And old Najimi was like, why? Like why? this discrimination i said the same thing no one cared about me <laughs> oh my god that was funny uh okay <laughs> all right and then comes the uh, dance event and like i was kind of correct here i knew that a, a lot of people would actually not realize that was tadano and there's a lot of people who were saying oh who's that person like that girl we've not seen her before and i think that's good that works out well here because you know like since people have this weird obsession with komi you know like if if sadano actually danced with her in his actual like you know like without uh, a disguise <laughs> his school life would have been over from the next day so it was good that yeah like he was in disguise and you know it worked out pretty well and uh, yeah and also najimi kind of you know oh and they were like having a moment and suddenly najimi comes in and yeah like i would have loved like you know like at least in the final episode for them to actually have like a moment together but nope najimi had to be there but as i said you know like as long as they have fun <laughs> yeah but i would have loved like you know a little bit a little bit development you know like it would have been okay if uh, tadano and komi just danced together for a moment and then they could resume it you know uh with like you know like uh, as a group dancing as a group but nah that it's too early you know like i think komi is still on going manga it's like 200 plus chapters so obviously this type of development was going to come probably in season 3 or season 4 <laughs> i don't think it's going to come before that <laughs> this type of like you know development of uh, the relationship between tadano and komi um yeah we have to wait quite a long time for any kind of development but yeah this is a slice of life obviously like you know like we we can wait and um yeah it's, it's nice to see these like you know this type of chill episodes and just you know having fun characters having fun and doing their own things all right there was that mm. oh and then comes the after celebration party after cultural festival party whatever um they go to the karaoke booth <laughs> Komi kind of was hesitating to put in, and she suddenly like you know fumbled and picked a song. All the different characters kind of sing their own song, you know, Otori, Naka Naka, Yamai, and Komi was also like you know 
singing, kind of. <laughs> so did not sing, but the music played. So and but everyone was able to hear Komi, you know, for, with the spiritual, um, you know, hearing ability. Everyone was like, oh my god, this is beautiful. Even though she's not singing, I can hear her. And <laughs> yeah, and. <laughs> The funny part of this was when the um, what's it called? Um, when the uh, what was it called? Yeah, when the song played and when it ended and when they showed the score that it was zero for Komi because Komi obviously didn't sing. Um, <laughs> Yamai was like, "Oh, I'm going to call them and I'm going to put a complaint. Like this thing is broken." And she actually goes outside and really calls them to complain. My god, this girl. <laughs> okay. And then Tadano comes, like, you know, thinking no one really cares. My god, that was kind of sad, I have to say. Um, even though, like, you know, his, you know, his other friends, like, uh, like, closer friends, for example, uh, Najimi, Komi, um, Agari, they were kind of, like, you know, listening and bobbing their heads. But like this is the thing, you know, like I really hope this actually changes. This is one thing that I, I really doesn't don't like this because it feels as if like, you know, like all the friends that we are seeing here, like I'm not including the closer ones, uh, Najimi, um, Komi, um, Agari, uh, a little bit Nakanaka Naka as well, you know, like we, we also are kind of acquainted with Nakanaka Naka. uh, and uh, what's her name? Uh, Yamai kind of, I guess, I'm not including them, I'm including the other characters who we've barely even seen. You know, th th those three guys, the ninja guy, the other two guy, uh, the girl, the, the, the night girl, you know, and the other girl, there's another girl there, I don't remember her. These characters, you know, um, I don't know, I kind of feel weird to actually see, like, you know, they're ba basically here because of Komi. Like, you know, like, they... I don't know, it's, it's like a weird feeling. I, I really hope that Komi, Tadano also makes friends, like, like you know, as, as he goes along side this journey with Komi. Like, I really doesn't, don't want this to become a thing centric on Komi always. Like, it's good to see stuff with Komi, but I would also like to see a little development with Tadano as well, you know. Like, this is, this is both their shows, you know, this is not, like, obviously the show's name is Komi Can't Communicate, I realize that. But still, Tadano is supposed to be the main character as well. So, like, you know, like seeing, like, you know, the other characters literally ignore him is a bit uh, sad, I know, you know. So, I really hope that this actually changes as time goes on. Like, Najimi is a good friend of him. Uh, that's, like, you know, that I know. And the other closer friends are also good friends with him. Um, but, you know, like, it, it's really kind of, I don't know, like, a, a little bit weird seeing... Like, you know, like, them just, the other characters just outright ignoring him. Like, kind of a little bit rude also, isn't it? But, yeah, what can I say? Like, you know, like, he, as he, as he said, like, he has, like, a very low presence, kind of average in a lot of ways. And so, yeah, he, he also needs to improve. Yeah, like, uh, you know, like, I, I, I guess he also needs to go and make friends. Not just always concentrate on Komi, but also like, you know, like work on his personal relationships as well. His social life as well. Like, it's good we are seeing stuff with Komi, but I would love to see some stuff with Tadano as well. Her, him also getting a little character development. Like, um, we are seeing character development each and every episode for Komi, but not for Tadano. I would love to see that. And I, and I really hope they do that in the future upcoming uh, seasons. And I don't know. Because, yeah, it, it's, it's a little bit sad to see him get outright ignored, you know, like, that's, that's kind of sad. Like, like, that scene, you know, like, he was singing and, like, everyone, like, as I said, like, it's very sad, like, he was singing and he actually looks at others and, like, you know, like, we see that the, this, this, this guy who was talking with some other girl, uh, and then, like, you know, Onemin is also talking with someone else, all this is happening, and no one is even looking at him. Like, I think that's a little bit sad, isn't it? Like, you know, like, at least pretend to pay attention, like, that's the least you can do. Like, why? Oh my god. <sighs> I think I'm a bit too... <laughs> you know, like... <laughs> 
that scene was a bit harsh <laughs> and the way tadano kind of like you know looked after that he was like oh my god like nobody cares about me <laughs> like it's not that i want to be like you know uh, listen to but at least you know like he was also saying stuff like that and then we see only komi was you know kind of hmm, i don't know what that was that thing you know doing that and uh, <laughs> and najimi was also listening to it i kind of saw that she was busy picking stuff i think and <laughs> and then yeah like that was that was okay yeah, I really hope, um, you know, Tadano also gets some improvement. And after that, obviously, Najimi just like her own self kind of drags them in, you know, drags Komi and Tadamo, Tadano in. And she was like, oh, let's sing together. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's good. I like, I really like Najimi actually, like, you know, trying to include um, them as well, because I'm sure Najimi realized that Tadano is probably a little bit awkward here as well. Because everyone's basically, like, you know, interested in Komi. Nobody actually cares about Tadano. And I'm, I'm sure Najmi felt a little bad for that and just, you know, like, included him as well. She, he was like, ah, we're all of us are here. Let's just have fun together. And included him in, in the song as well. So, yeah, it's good. Yeah. That's why I'm saying, you know, the, only the closer friends, they are, they're good friends with, Komi, uh, with Tadano. But other than that, I feel like there's, like, like nobody actually cares about him and that's a little bit sad you know <laughs> it's as if they're just pretending to be friends just because you know there's someone else like i actually realize why i really feel bothered by this thing you know like it actually feels as if like as i said they're basically like i'm talking about the other characters they're basically kind of like you know pretending not pretending but they're just there for komi and like you know like that's one thing like if they were like a real group of friends and everyone was interacting with everyone it would have been better but as i said you know it would take a little bit of time for actually tadano to be that forward like he also himself also needs to improve his own communication skills and yeah so anyways just okay anyways just that was just it uh, i'm sure he'll also like you know improve get a little character development in the future as well hopefully just like Komi is growing, he'll also probably grow. So yeah. And the last part we see Komi with her, you know, like the notebook with the different names written. You know, 13 friends. <laughs> so yeah. And then the final part was <laughs> was interesting, you know, they were like doing a little shoot, TV shoot or whatever. And they was like, they were like, come on, trust her. She can do it. And she did it. She was actually able to say, uh, you know, April 20th, 2022 will be back. So thank you for your, you know. <laughs> yeah. Look forward to it. That was it. So that was this episode. So this was the final episode of this season. Next season will start April 2022. I'll be back then again um, with some new more, some new reactions. To Komi can't communicate so yeah so that's it guys thank you guys for watching this was my reaction to Komi can't communicate episode number 12 if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed and comment down below anything you want to say anything you want to let me know and i'll check them out so yeah that's it guys so since this is the final episode of Komi can't communicate obviously this will be replaced with another show um i'll talk about which shows i'll do later on in the community post uh, but for now i have actually put out a poll in my community tab you know for an anime you can vote there there are five options i think um i'll start that anime whichever anime gets the more maximum votes i'll start that from january and there will be a few other animes that i'm going to start as well which will be coming from winter 2022 uh, there are a few of my like you know like uh, like obviously i'm going to react to attack on titan um demon Slayer is ongoing still you know i'm going to obviously continue that um two more shows i have my eyes on which i probably will react to from january is uh sono bisco doll wa koi wo suru and uh, karakai jozu no takagi -san, these two i will probably start them as well like i'll have to like you know i'll have to see if i have enough time to react to them i'll that'll that i'll decide later on 
but this will probably be the, be the show i'll be reacting to in january so anyway so that's it so thank you guys for watching so i'll see you guys in the next video until then goodbye and have a nice day